Hi guys, it's Simone from Sparkly Fairy Face Painting teaching super easy balloons. So, um, so far if you've seen any of my other videos, you will have seen the easy sword, mouse, dog, giraffe, space gun and bee. And flower. So, today I'm going to do a dragonfly. Now, if you've done the space gun, this is where to start because it's an extension on the space gun. And actually, I learnt the dragonfly and while I was learning it, I realised this looks a bit like a gun. This could easily be a space gun. So, we start with the space gun first, which I'll just do now. But I'm not going to use silver. I might just use what colour? I might use green. Okay. So... In case any of you don't know when you're starting out, metallics are harder to work with. They're just a stiffer latex. So if you're having any problems at all, just stay away from the metallics. Okay, so, but I have a metallic green. I've left a little bit of a nipple at the end. I'm going to burp a bit out here to save my fingers. Tying it off. Now, first thing is a knobble. One, two, three, few twists. And then we fold over. We want to leave enough to be able to pass our balloon through, but not so much that we run out of balloon. Twist, twist, twist. So we have this. I'm going to do another novel. One, two, three, few twists. Fold it over again. Again, enough room to put the balloon through, but not so much we run out of balloon. Twist, twist, twist. Okay. So we end up with this. We're going to pass this bit of the balloon through. So, this is our space gun, but also the start of our dragonfly. Right, so space gun, pew, 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 pew. Dragonfly goes up this way. The next thing to do is to, you can either put the eyes in or you can put the wings on. Uh, I might put the eyes in. So, to do the eyes, you need a small round balloon. I'm not sure the size of that. Let me see. I've got a bag in here. Uh, okay. They say they are 12.7 centimetres. And I think maybe that's 5 inches. Uh, these are 50 in a pack. It's Amscan. Amscan is the brand. Anyway, it's a small balloon. Uh, similar to a water bomb, you want to blow it up not too far, okay? Because you have to twist the balloon in half. So, definitely not so it's tight. I'm going to tie that off. Now, this is probably the hardest part of the whole thing. So, you want to twist this balloon in half. You want the twist, like when we do our wings, you want this part, the tie, to be in the middle. You don't want it hanging out the end of an eyeball. So just remember that. So you need to twist on that so that's in the middle. So now they do tend to go a bit uneven. I don't think that matters too much. It sort of looks a bit cartoon. So I'm getting my big long fingers around and I'm going to twist this whole balloon in half. If it's blown up too high, it will pop or it just won't twist. Okay, so let's see. Sometimes they go sideways. Alright, so I have got one big eye, one small eye. I'm going to not care about it and just pretend, oh, it's a crazy dragonfly. You know, in cartoons, how they have one eye bigger than the other. So put your eyeballs, put your eyeballs through that hole and arrange them so they're sort of long ways. Give them an extra twist while they're in there if you want. So you can see that. Then you can pull this part to really secure them in. Okay. So we've got one small eye, one big eye. But I'm not going to care on this one. Practice makes perfect. And once you get really practiced, you can make your eyes similar sizes. Okay. Now to put the wings on. So... You can do any manner of combination of colours. They all look great. I'm going to do purple for this one. So, 
Uh, much like when you make your flour, pump your balloon up, leaving a bit of nipple at the end so that you can tie it off. You probably don't need that much. Uh, and burp a bit of air out so that you get this stretchy to tie it off and save your fingers. Right. Tie your two ends together. Alright, so like with so many other designs, here's your tie, that's the bit you're pressing to the middle to make your figure of eight. Give it a few twists, pass it through. I don't know if that really does anything. People say it does, so, you know, we'll do it. Now, to attach the wings to your dragonfly, it goes in that knobble there. So you're using that knobble to attach it through here. So, you can give it a bit of a twist or whatever. And there you have it. There's your dragonfly. Now all you need to do is put your, draw your eyeballs on. That'll make it look good. Where's my permanent marker? Make sure you have a permanent marker, not a whiteboard marker. All right, so here we go. We're gonna go crazy eyes. And a little mouth. You have to have a little smiley mouth. Oh, he's so cute. He's really darling. And the kids just love them. And the mums are always really impressed. So there he is, you super cool. Really very easy dragonfly. It's just the space gun. Add some eyeballs. Pop on some wings. And he's done.